Look at how crazy the difference is. Ready? <laughs> Dude, this takes forever. Thank you. <laughs> what? <laughs> Yo. <laughs> good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, everybody. Hi. Fifteen minutes later. <laughs> Today, I have no idea what we're doing. I'm down to do a lot of stuff. <laughs> Whoa, okay. All right, boys, in honor of not having showered yet today, it's time to release my inner gamer gunk. It's rune light time. <laughs> First, a word from this video sponsor. Boys, let me tell you, I have been on the earbud grind for quite some time. I find something at a slightly expensive price point. The audio quality is excellent, but the build quality, not so much. And then I find one at a slightly lower price point, more inexpensive, sound quality is not quite there, and then I move on. And at this point, it's been like an entire year since I've used earbuds. So when Raycon reached out to me, I was like, okay guys, you know what? If you send me over a product so I can test it out and see if I like it or not, and if I enjoy it, I have no problem doing a sponsor. So no, it's backwards, dude. Raycon Everyday Earbuds. Fellas, let me tell you, for the price point, these bad boys right here are not half bad at all. So my top priority when I use earbuds is sound quality. And the sound quality on these, pretty dang good. The sound stage is quite good. The, you know, the placement of all the instruments, you know, relative to where you're listening, it sounds pretty dang full, quite frankly. There's also active noise cancelization, which for this price point is pretty much unheard of. And there's also the polar opposite of that, which is awareness mode. And another very good feature about these little guys right here, the battery life, 32 hours. That's including being inside of the case because you know the case charges them, but 32 hours. Finally, and a reason why I probably haven't had very much success in the past with some earbuds is they are waterproof and sweat resistant. The latter of which is quite important for me because while I'm working out, I love to use the Raycons because they stay nice and snug in my ears while the sweat is uh, pouring down. And while the wireless charging case here is pretty cool, you know what's even cooler than that? Ooh, how about a case for your case, baby? Not only is it a little more stylish, it protects your case and your earbuds. And with the upcoming Black Friday and Cyber Monday sales, you can go to buyraycon.com slash bully for up to 30% off site-wide. And thank you to Raycon for sponsoring this video. All right, here's my character. I'm level 97. So I had the quest cape up until Song of the Elf. So they've released this many quests. They've added 25 quests to the game. Oh, you can literally see it right here. <laughs> 28 quests. Well, 27. You cannot get banned for using 117's plugin, right? Nothing in the plugin hab is bannable. All right, cool. I'm gonna try this out. Do you have to restart it? Oh, shoot. Yo, wait, that's that's so cool. It just instantly updates it. Wait, that's awesome. I love the 2010 graphics. Unlock FPS. Dude, no way. Oh, that's so good. What's the mist? I don't want the mist. None. Uh, maybe you do want a little bit of fog. Uh, I think I like this more. I could use this. Like, just look at how crazy the difference is. Ready? <laughs> You better have door kicker. Wait, what door kicker? Assert your dominance against the doors. So do you straight up just... <laughs> <laughs> the door seems to be stuck. Wait, what? Is this to prevent grief? Did they add anti-griefing into this game? Look at that, dude. Draken's medallion, berserker ring imbued, fire cape. Dude, I got this fire cape. I'm not kidding. I think I was level... Here it is. Level 68, not 58. 68. Look at that. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. I had Nietzanot, Fury, Fighter Torso, Barrow's Gloves, and a Fire Cape. I literally had 50 defense. That's why I'm wearing granite. I didn't have enough to uh, use dragon yet. What is this? What the ball of wool? That's what wool looks like on the ground. <laughs> Wait, it looks like a sperm thing. <laughs> All right, let's create a new account, boys. But I've never played Iron Man. Woo! Let's go. Name is not available. Yeah, there it is. Woogie. Are you kidding me? Who, Who took it? Who took it? Which one of you little punks took it? Woogie. Woogie's available. <sighs> I know exactly what I want my character to look like. I do it every time. Pronouns! All right, are we going in? This is the character. Looking like a gamer. That render distance. Beautiful. I didn't even know there was a dock there. Wait, what? <laughs> yes, I do want to become an Iron Man. Oops, forgot about that. My bad. Hardcore Iron Man. In addition to the standard Iron Man rules, a hardcore Iron Man only has one life going in, baby. We're here. First thing we do, pickpocket a man. <laughs> Dang it! Ben Jover, my man. Oh, don't you get a gear, by the way? You get, like, Iron Man gear. 
armor. Here we go. Wear it with pride. Wait, dude, this is some OP stats. All right. Uh, pretty sure the skeleton is like level 20 down here or something. It can't one shot us. Oh, leather boots. Best in slot. Best in slot. Do these not give any stats, actually? Oh, they do. Yeah, plus one, plus one, baby. You brought me everything I need. There you go, brother. There you go. All right, you can start the next quest already, right? Oh, yeah, you have to be a member. Duh. Okay. Oh, shoot. I found the treasure. Yay. Woohoo. All right, Fred, I got your wool, man. You have like seven crafting levels for this, I'm pretty sure. It's 150? Am I... <laughs> Wait. He didn't even take them. Wait, he didn't take them. Wait, I shared 19. Wait, 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 wait. Is it only 20? This quest used to be 25. I know that for a fact. And he only, he only took one. Yeah, he, they changed it. Uh-oh. Puzzle. What? Is that a joke? Which one is it coming out of? All right, it's coming out of that one. Can I get there in time? Uh-oh. One, two, go up there. Come on, right there. Go. <laughs> I didn't go far enough. Come on, baby. Hit it. Perfect timing. Let's go. Wait, you have to do it multiple times? A lot of boring math later. So yeah, the twist, unfortunately, did not surprise me. 600, that's where the crafting XP I was thinking of came in. Just free to play? Yeah, I'm just free to play for right now. I'll probably buy membership uh, very, very, very soon. Why are there three guys in the exact same gear? I wonder if I this level 44, level 48, and level 47 using bronze med help iron chain iron leg iron kite and mithril scimitar i wonder if these are other iron med helms by the way hmm very interesting i guess they're like a clan or something oh another one yay okay uh restless ghost we need to go talk to the guy in the swamp and then we will eat some booty and then all right here we go boys this is huge this is a huge moment for the account can we do it it's a huge moment for the account. Let's go. I got it. 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 Oh my gosh. It's so easy. Juiced to our gills right now. Give me a quest, please. Start the imp catcher. Actually, let's go turn on the skull first. Might as well. Plus 5% defense. Wait, we didn't start rune mysteries. Oh! Oh! Cutscene. Oh! Woo! Perfect. We get the 10% defense prayer going into the stronghold security, so we can't die now. It's impossible. Come here, Hetty. Woman. Now drink from the cauldron. <laughs> hey, was that eight magic or something? Five? What? All right, now we're kitted, boys. Rate my drip. We've been playing for what? Two hours or something? Rate my drip. Rate the two hour point drip. We got the leather gloves, leather boots, full hardcore Iron Man, ghost beak amulet, training sword, training shield. Yeah. All right, boys. We're in the dangerous part of the account. The most dangerous step. You just spam click these things, right? You don't have to uh, talk to them, I don't think. Yeah, there we go. Well, I got sucked. I'm not going to say it. Wait, I got a lamp? What's this? Shoo! Cheesh! I should wait for agility, man. I'm doing prayer there. 110 XP? Wait, that's crazy. We're just walking through. Nothing's aggroing me, dude. This game's too easy. All right. First piece of the puzzle, boys. I need to not run. We need our run energy coming right up. Easy clap, dude. Let's go. Woohoo! All right, let's go down. GG. Only a one. We take those, baby. I'm not going to the bottom floor, guys. I am not going to the bottom floor. Give me my money. Woohoo! This is for all the marbles, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going across the room, right? Yeah, across is better. I'm going in. Wait, no, that door is definitely better. Zero! Get wrecked! Oh! Should we go to the bottom floor? What do you guys think? Should we get our boot? I'm doing it. You know what? I'm, I'm not a baby. I'm going in. Ah. Go, 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 go! Let's go, my heroes. All right, dude, do we go bottom floor? As far as I'm concerned, this is the max reward right here. 10K cash. Look at that bad boy. Look at that cash stack right there. <sighs> okay, so long as I have run energy, there's no way I can die here. I'm going in, boys. Woo! Turn on prayer. Let's go. Eight. Okay, we got an eight. Okay, we're good. Get in there. Let's go. <laughs> it's too easy. Give me those. All right, do we go fighter boots or colorful boots? Wait, you think the mixture? The fancier boots. Whoa. Spiky boots? I think just the spiky boots. I'm going to role play here. Wait, they give negative attack bonus? No way. All right. We need to buy a Chronicle, which is in freaking Lumbridge, man. <laughs> Ooh. Imp time. Can we punch an imp to death? Yellow bead. Yellow bead. Yellow bead. Take that. Come on. No. The yellow bead is mine. Dude. Dude. Stop! Stop moving! Give me the yellow bead. Come on, baby. Four attack. Ball of wool. You having a giggle? 
but it gives you hit points experience. That's why I would want to do it early. Shremel, what is that? Literally role playing. I mean, that scythe wasn't in the game, but role playing and like freaking. What the heck? <laughs> Yo. <laughs> with the clown shoes on, the killer with the clown shoes on. <laughs> All right, let's do Imp Catcher real quick. We might as well. I'll, keep, I'll stay logged in, boys. I'm already addicted. Ooh, wait, if I teleport, does it put me out in Varrock? TP me, baby. No? What do you mean, no? Don't lie to me. Watch. Shake on it. I bet you $10 it puts me in Varrock. I bet you $10. You ready? <laughs> 10 GP. Shake on it. Uh, how else would I get burnt meat? I gotta kill a cow and get the meat. All right, we'll just go over to Lumberge real quick. Wait, aren't there cows? Yeah, there's cows by the crafting guild. Yeah, they're right inside of the freaking... Uh, wait. This might not count as a guild. Nah, it definitely is a guild. Surely. Whoa, it's not! Oh my gosh, it doesn't count. Dude, the RuneScape knowledge is coming in clutch. Beautiful. Yeah, safe spot, boys. We're gaming. Woo! 1,500, boom. 1,500 schmeckles. Look at that. Now we're self-casting, baby. There's another one. Yeah, they respawn right here. Four damage already? Dude. Yellow bead. Oh my gosh. Who is this guy? Who is this guy? You can tag him. So what do you mean? Oh. Wait, so it'll highlight all imps on the map? Wait, that's so busted. Oh my gosh, it's just there. That's that's so incredibly good. Where'd the imp go? It shows you how much... He's in the wall. I didn't know this was possible. Did you guys know this was possible? The imp is in the wall. Dude, he's in the wall too. Wait, they're both in the wall. Yo, come on. We're literally one-shotting imps now. Come on, black bead. Dang, dude. Five minutes later. Brother, give me the freaking black bead or I'm going to do something heinous. I'm going to do something that I really shouldn't do on stream. And I'll make sure everything is in view of the camera. If I don't get the black bead in the next three imp kills, I'm going to do something despicable on camera. Two kills away. <laughs> saved. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, you're saved. All right, Imp Catcher is done. The hardest quest in the game. How do you get the shortest path to actually do something? Do you, like right click on the world map or something? I'm gonna go here. Oh, here we go. Set target. Dang, look at that. Scrumbo, get out of my cutscene. The killer. The killer found me. Amulet of accuracy. GG. 16 magic, 13 combat. Dang. All right, let's get a rune med helm. What would you guys do if I get a rune med helm on my first kill? Watch this. Three, two, one. Three death runes. Wow, thank you. Oh, a chocolate cake and some stew. 14 cooking. We're OP. Dude, this takes forever. Thank you. What? How did you just hide? This is a kind of dangerous quest, so we'll see. Hello, young man. What's the matter? I lost my ball. The witch took it. Kiss the queen. It's a prince! Ah! All right, watch this, boys. Just wait till she passes. GG. Nah, I'll make it. I'll make it. We win these. We win these. Boop. All right, uh, we could die here if I uh, mess this up. All right, if this hits me, I'm TPing. Not taking damage. GG. GG. All right, after this, uh, let's do the two quests back in Barok, and then we'll do freaking... Waterfall. It's waterfall time after this, ladies and gentlemen. There it is. Hey, we leveled up hit points doing the hit points quest. All right, take the ball and then don't get caught. I'm going to time it and we're good. Go. Let's go. Who is this guy? Witch's house. Hardest quest for an ultimate hardcore gamer man. Done. <laughs> you better watch your mouth, Scromo. You better watch your mouth, Scromo. Let's go, baby. I got your balls. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Four quest points. 6,000 hit points experience. We are level 20. Five hit points. Boom! Now, name one thing that can kill me right now. Name one single thing that can kill me with 25 health. Level 18. Name one thing. Shh. Everyone be quiet. This is huge. Let me focus up. Oh my gosh. I'm about to run past him. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I, get, I, I get gassy when I get nervous. Sorry. Oh my gosh. Stop it. Woohoo, baby. Playing with fire. Going. Oh my gosh. It was close. GD. Sergeant Tobian. Yeah, I know. There's a ton of new stuff. Already, I've seen some new stuff. I've done a couple new quests. That was it? That's a quest? I got a cooked chicken. Oh, no. Just had a cooked chicken icon. All right. Daddy's home. Daddy's home. All right, brother Omad. I got you, brother man. Hey, oh, you get law runes for that? The law runes are so good, actually, for Iron Man. That's crazy. There we go. 2K XP. <laughs> Search haystack. Do I get a needle? Let's see. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. 
Punk. Dang. Wait, that's awesome. You can see the whole thing. This plugin is so cool, man. V this is totally giving me a new perspective. Like, I know how the stuff is, and I, I know what it looks like roughly, but being able to see the waterfall like that, that's so sick. And then there's a door. You can't get in it. You need to get the amulet, and then blah, blah, blah. Not lose hardcore to waterfall. We are not losing hardcore status to waterfall. I guarantee you. Can I make it across the log on the first try? Can we do it? I got you. Oh, we did it first try. GG. Are those Torax hammers? <laughs> oh, he's smiting them. Oh, oh, oh. Feast on those souls, sir. All right. Yeah, we have to be careful of uh, getting two tapped by a moss giant, but we should be good, though. All we have to do is run past the moss giant. Three, two, one. <laughs> we got the zombie aggro. Let's go. Easy, dude. Boom. <laughs> Oh, he aggroed again, too. Oh, we're chilling. It's too easy. All right, here's the real one. All right, let's get the zombie to aggro. Here we go. Ah! Okay, we're good. We're calm down. We did it. All right, we're going out, and we're good. Yes, I'll see what I can do. Let me go talk to the people in a... All right, open the door. Dude, waterfall quest is so good. We're able to, like, we get like 30 attack and strength, right? Off of this. Easy. Watch this, boys. Ready? Dude, who time? Ban that guy right now. Nar ban him. Ban Narza right now. Do not left click. Use the urn on the. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. Oh. Boom. 13,750 strength. 13,750 attack. Two diamonds. Two gold bars. 40. Mithril. See. Boom. What level will we get? 30. 30 attack, 30 strength. So easy. All right, uh, I think the next quest is gonna be. Ah! Oh! Fart on my roommate's door. Oh! Amy, that's not needed after the quest. Wait, really? Oh, shit, fart on my roommate's door. Ha. Did you see it? On the left side? All right, so you said I go to the northwest. He'll get stuck on the wall on a tree when trying to drag you. So, right here? Where do I go? There we go. Good call, Rosie. Good call. Eight. Dude, hitting an eight with wind strike is still so crazy to me. I think I just walk back to the stronghold anyway for this quest. Sit down, buddy. You can hit up to a 16. Wait, what's the max hit with wind strike? It just keeps scaling and scaling and scaling. That's crazy. All right, we should be 40 attack off of this. I think you get 42 after all three of these quests. Let's see. Oh, you get thieving XP too. That's sick. And you get 1,000 GP. Yeah, 40 attack on the dot. Never mind. Look at that. Dopamine, baby. Woo! Look at those stats. 40 attack, 30 strength, 26 health, 46 agility, 20 magic, 14 thieving, 15 wood. Oh, baby. We're chilling. Bang. Wow. All right, we should get nine slayer and nine hunter. Boom. Huge. Might be just getting some dragon bones. Sammy, please don't kill me. He's darkin' me. No. That was close. <laughs> All right, Herblore, level three, baby. Die. Boom. All right, there's. All right, we kill the dog. Level 30, no way. Wait, you have to melee it? You have to melee it? Oh, no. Well, we're gonna be here for uh... the following day. Let's go. <laughs> Are you a complete imbecile? Maybe. <laughs> The writing in this game is so good, dude. All right, let's get down there, boys. Access to Canifis coming in hot. What is that? You can literally search it. Look, look at the render distance. I can climb the ladder from here. Prayer XP and the Wolf Bane Dagger. 17 prayer. All right, let's pass through the barrier and boom. We're there, boys. Canifis. Mortania. All right. Hello, everybody. I was uh, doing some agility training over here in Canifis and then the shooting star fell. So I'm finishing up mining this right now. And I figured I'd hop on the mic to just talk about what the plans I have for the series are and if there are any plans in general. Long story short, uh, no, no plans particularly. I'm basically just using RuneScape as a way to stall until Path of Exile 2. I'm very excited for PoE2 coming out on December 6th. And I tried Brighter Shores out, which many of you probably are familiar with. The Gower brothers are the original creators of RuneScape, specifically Andrew, and he made a new MMO. Long story short, Brighter Shores. I tried it out and I was like, all right, boys, if Brighter Shores is not quite it, uh, I'll go over to RuneScape and make a hardcore Iron Man. And given the fact that you're watching this video on a hardcore Iron Man, <laughs> that's exactly what happened. So yeah, no real long-term goals with this series. I mainly just want to play and experience all the new stuff 
stuff that's been added to the game since the last time I played. I'm no stranger to RuneScape. I've been playing for a very, very, very long time as my first childhood game, like online game. But in terms of old school RuneScape, the last time I played was right before Song of the Elves. So I remember they put out the stat requirements. I got all the requirements before the quest came out and I figured I was gonna, you know, keep playing once it came out. And then I just never got back on the game. <laughs> anyway, so for this character specifically, no long-term things right now. Maybe you guys can help me with the ideas in that regard. Again, December 6th is basically my cutoff date for RuneScape. I'll probably like grind some stuff AFK while I play PoE 2, I'm sure. Reasonably like, you know, three weeks. What can I accomplish in the next three weeks of playing on a hardcore Iron Man. First time Iron Man, by the way. I don't know if uh, I've said that at all in this video so far. So short-term goals. Obviously right now we're doing agility. Um, I think I'm level 55 right now. Yeah, I'm level 55. Uh, gonna hit 56 pretty soon. I have how many marks of grace? 110. And I already have the hood and the gloves. So I think you need, is it like 200 to get the remaining pieces? I think the cape is the most expensive, right? Oh, no, the legs. The legs are 70. I think it's 70, like 50 for both of these. Oh, a beehive event. Let's go, baby. So I'll be doing agility for a little while longer. I think staying at Canifus is the most optimal way to do it. I think that's the right way. Or is the lid go one more above? Oh, perfect. Let's go, baby. What do we get? We got an XP lamp and beekeeper gloves. Hey, XP lamp. I'll take that. I'll put it on Herblore. Boom. 30 XP. 30 XP. I'll take that, baby. So short-term goals, as I was saying. Finish graceful. I don't know how long it'll take. Uh, well, it actually leveled me up. That's awesome. For four Herblore. Sick. Uh, but I'd imagine maybe like five hours at most. Then I think I'm actually going to hit up the agility pyramid just for a little bit get some uh some cash you get ten thousand dollars cash hard-earned schmeckeldorf double a -doos. anyway at risk of making this recording way too freaking long after agility we will do ardonge uh the cloak so we'll get the tier one cloak that gives us infinite access to the monastery and after that probably just you know more questing grand tree and uh holy grail all that stuff and then maybe a, a good short long-term goal if that makes sense would be i don't know i'm trying to think i'd rather just experience the new stuff um i've heard varlamor is really cool how do you say that valamore varlamor i think it's valamore i've heard that region is actually pretty cool Z Zaya, I've heard, has had some massive overhaul. So maybe I'll check out Zaya, Varlamore, and uh, try to get to like the mid-game stuff. Maybe I'll get like level 70 combat-ish. Find some cool things that I've never done before. That would be pretty neat. Oh, and then obviously a uh, fairy ring. So that'll, that'll definitely be uh, before we start, you know, branching out and doing all this interesting stuff. Fairy ring traveling. Very, very important, especially on an Iron Man. Also, wow, one final thing. Rune light. Boys, when I played, like, Runelight existed and it had some cool stuff in it, but wow, like, this was basically the most, the coolest plugin was the Rooftop Agility plugin. I think this existed when I played last. Dude, smoothing animations, the 117 HD. Oh, dude, like, this game looks awesome awesome very 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 good yeah i love this game so much i'm very 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 happy to be playing this game again this is my childhood game all right anyway thank you guys for vibing hanging out watching chilling with the boys hope you guys enjoyed 07 in the chat Ooh.